going on guys today we're trying to hit level 13 as you can see we're pretty close let's uh get right into it <laughs> guys i just hit level 13 after i did that little intro i started donating cards <laughs> got to level 13 right away congratulations you've reached maximum king level now you earn star points from cards upgrades and donation donating max level cards use star points to unlock cosmetics a gold valkyrie how many of these bad boys do I need? 10,000? How how fast or slow do I get them? I don't know, but I'm finally level 13. Holy crap. I don't. I only have one level 13 card in my deck, though. So that kind of sucks. My uh, Valkyrie. Oh, right, well, no, wait. I think that's it, yeah. Alright. Let's get right into this game here. Valkyrie right here. As soon as those guys lock on. Skeleton archers and then poison that furnace. Now we're just gonna wait it out. Let's see, we, see what he does here. I need uh I need to get some more level 13 cards. As you guys could see in that last segment, you can see I have three cards that are ready for upgrade. Miners ready to go to level 12, poison's ready to go to level 13, and so is ice spirits level 13. Wow. I'm gonna miner back here. Then I'm gonna get ready for the Valkyrie on this. Ice Wizard. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna log back both of those. Just for value. So far he hasn't thrown out anything that really needs needs to be logged. Okay. I just want I need to need this royal ghost to die so he doesn't kill my skeletons like that. There we go. I can miner back there. Is at least one of those gonna? Dang it! I wanted at least one of those guys to hop onto that skeleton to be wasted. Whatever, he's gonna get one hit. That's fine. I have Inferno Tower right here at the ready for this Pekka mini Pekka. My log. I don't know why that log took so long to come out. Just don't. Okay, he didn't take me down. So there we go. We got about a thousand hit point lead on him. Is the music playing? Can you guys hear? Yeah, I can kind of hear it. So, when I was recording the other videos, or when I was editing my other videos, I realized that I didn't have the music playing, like the Clash Royale music. And so, it was just like a lot of empty, empty noise. So, I'm glad that like I caught on to that and realized it. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna wait until... Uh-oh. I don't like... So, I want a miner back there. And I'm gonna Valkyrie here for these two. Oh crap, Clash of Clans notification. Actually, uh, I used to play Clash of Clans a lot, but not really anymore. I just have it on the iPad. Okay, so Inferno Top's gonna take care of this mini P.E.K.K.A. We're gonna have to poison. I just like poisoning the furnaces because the Ice Spirits die as they come out and I'm getting all that free damage on the tower itself. Valkyrie right here, that was a dumb log on his part. I like it. I'm gonna skeletons right here to get rid of these. Get rid of the fire spirits. Oops. And then I wanna miner back here. Now the miner is gonna pull back those fire spirits and take out that take out that furnace at the same time. I'm gonna have Valkyrie here to distract this royal ghost, and then I'm gonna drop the inferno tower. Crap, that hurt. Okay, those I have skeletons here to delay this mini P.E.K.K.A. and then I'm just gonna... Oh man, I uh, did not have poisoned that, that furnace, but that's okay. I think we can... we're just about ready to take this guy. There we go. Alright, that was a that was a nice easy game. It feels good to not play against a max at level 13. And that was my first, um, first one as a level 13 King Tower, dude. Alright, let's hop right into the next one, shall we? Another guy that's not level 13. So I am playing in the morning time, and maybe that's why I'm not playing against all these level 13s. Like, I'm just playing against the casual players who are just waking up and playing the game. Where when you, when I played towards the end of the day, like when people are getting off of work, kids are getting out of school. That's when it, like, literally, it'll be like five or six games in a row where I'm playing against full maxed out, like, gold decks. It's the most annoying thing in the world. By far. Let's see, is he gonna play anything else? After that wizard? I, I mean, I don't wanna leave. 
Okay, here we go. He did play something else. Took him a little bit to decide. Sorry, I uh, didn't uh, mute my phone if you guys were able to hear that. Alright, so right here we got our Valkyrie taking on the e -barb. Dude, Valkyrie being able to kill E-Barbs has saved me from quitting this game. Because the E-Barbs, when they just get, when level 13 E-Barbs get spammed at the bridge, it makes me want to cry. We're going to Ice Spirit and Miner back here. We'll have the log ready to see if he does anything crazy. I don't want to do any predicting logs. He doesn't show me really anything that needs to be logged. And right here, man, I wanted to poison that wizard. I want to see if I can delay... Yeah, here we go. Because I want the Valkyrie to take out the wizard, not the knight. There we go. Because I don't want that wizard to get any damage on my tower. We're going to go ahead and poison him. He doesn't really... Sh not... Not that I can remember, he hasn't really shown me anything else that need I need to be saving poison for. And I'll also go ahead and log him to make sure the executioner dies. And I get Crown Tower. So we got a um, pretty good pretty good lead on this guy. I split up the E-Barbs. I actually didn't want to do that, but it works out. He did get a hit on my tower though. A jerk. So we're now gonna be going into overtime. So I'll be able to cycle pretty fast. I'm gonna, so since I'm in overtime. I'm gonna go ahead and just throw the Inferno Tower out, because if I play correctly, I should be able to have Inferno Tower out, like, at all times during double, during double elixir. Because if I can just keep cycling back to it. Now, oh, there we go, he, he does have a Skarmie in there for the poison. And see, look, right now my Inferno Tower is dead because they nerfed it. Wow, he's just now throwing out... This is, oh no, this is not good. I have to kill these E-Barbs, I can't. Okay, that balloon's going down for sure, so that's good. I was worried that I wasn't going to have my e was out in time uh, <laughs> for that balloon. So I'm going to Skeleton Miner, and I'm also going to Log right here, just in case he does Skarmie. I should have been, I haven't been card counting to see if he had played four cards yet between the Skarmies. Now we have, we're going to get ready for a big push here. So he has Inferno Tower. Or I have Inferno Tower up. Uh-oh. I just need to keep this Eva's alive at all costs right now. No, no, no. You know, that was a bad Inferno Tower. Because no matter what. Whatever. Whatever. We're good. I just have to Miner, Poison, and Log this right tower. And we'll be golden. So we'll just do all that right here. That should do it, right? Oh, yeah. That does it. So... Heck yeah, man. It feels good to get some wins going. Alright, guys. Can we go three for three here? Uh, I'm trying to decide how many matches I want to do in these Clash Royale games. I don't want them to be long videos. Like, too long of videos. Like, between five and ten minutes. Like, I don't really want to go higher than ten minutes. Uh, just because, like, it, it, it would get less clicks, I would think. So, a Golem Beatdown deck. These are my least favorite to play against, I would say. And right now, it's a level 13 golem beat down deck, which really just hurts my feelings. But, let's see what we go on here. I got lucky that, he, or if he does have Tornado, he's not using it yet. But I placed that Miner in a really bad spot. Now we're in a lot of trouble, because he has Rocket. He has Rocket, and that hurts. So I heard that, um, I heard that they're possibly going to be nerfing, or changing the golem where he does less death damage which would be di would be different i don't know i don't really think i don't know i don't know how i feel about it the golem isn't too crazy he is really annoying and i don't like dealing with him but i'm sure that if they take away his death damage because he gets so much value out of that they're gonna have to up his health points or something like they can't just completely nerf him because golem is the key in so many decks like just so there's so many golem beat down like variation decks i'm just going all in on this left side when he places that golem down and now what really sucks is i can't really place inferno tower because he has rocket but i have to i just need to wait for that mega minion to get taken out yeah he just had that so fast Dude, this sucks. So now he has these bats, which means I can't Valkyrie yet. I need to uh, E-Wiz. Man. I'm gonna go ahead and Miner right here. 
just so while we're getting destroyed, I can at least get something going as well. Do I Valkyrie? Oh man, I don't think I'm gonna Valkyrie that. So now that I just two times, I'm gonna get my. Oh man, I just gotta find a way to keep my Inferno Tower at the ready. Like, I need to place one in time for him to rocket it. And then I need to cycle back to another one fast. So I'm gonna get this left tower down, but now that it's two times, this is where his deck's gonna start shining for sure. So let's see how we can defend here. I'm gonna place high Inferno Tower. I know he's gonna rocket it. So I'm gonna cycle back to another Inferno Tower real quick. Okay. So now we got our Inferno Tower back. I just need that their Inferno Tower is going to go down. And then we need to poison this Tombstone. So that way I don't start getting overwhelmed by spammy troops. I need my Inferno Tower to focus the goal. Let's see what we can do here. Trying to get some good, good damage going. We're going to place Inferno Tower high. Expect him to rocket it. That's okay. Now we're gonna. This is not fine anymore. This, our heat is totally not fine anymore. Oh man, come on, come on, come on. He was, he was, he was. No! Please. Get off my tower. Get off of my tower. Everyone. No, and he just rocketed it. Man, dude. Trying to get a golem deck is so hard. Dude, especially because he had rockets to perfectly counter my Inferno Tower. That really sucks. That really sucks, but that's alright. I, um... What I kind of want to start doing, like, speak, like, speaking of that golem deck, is, like, I want to be able to play different variation decks, like golem decks and stuff, but I can't because I don't have... Like, let's see, do I have a golem deck? Yeah, like, look, this is my golem deck. Level 9, 10, 9, 10, 10, 9, 10, 9. Like, nothing's even level 11. I'm constantly playing against level 13s. And I know I can upgrade a lot of these cards. But if your cards aren't level 13, you can't play ladder. I, I have 1,500 gems, so I think I need to start doing some, like, classic challenges to start before I do grand challenges. But we'll see. That's going to do it for this video, guys. Thank you for uh, stopping by and watching me win a couple and then get destroyed by a golem deck.